Okay, so rather than waiting for questions, I know there was a lot of speculation uh, over the course of our game uh, and uh, about a possible trade. There is no trade. Um, and uh, unfortunately, um, social media, et cetera, uh, got ahead of the facts. And, um, you know, it may have had an adverse effect on, uh, you know, one of the players rumored to be involved. And uh, it was an unfortunate situation. It was something that... Uh, um, uh, we've we've addressed uh, direct. I've addressed personally with uh, uh, the player involved, and um, um, it's one of those th- things that happens in uh, <clears throat> you know today and with uh, modern communications, etc. So it's an unfortunate situation. But um, you know whatever has been speculated uh, over the course of the evening uh, has not and will not transpire. So just to clarify, I mean, you just said that, but will not transpire, so that... Will not transpire, right. So the talks with Milwaukee are dead on the calls from us. That's, I, you can interpret it that way, yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm just trying to figure it out. Yeah, right. How bad do you feel for Wormer? Well, it's, it, you know, it, it was an unfortunate situation, and so, you know, we could we could have pulled him and contributed to the speculation, and... Um, um, at the same time, um, we're trying to win a game, and given uh, you know various considerations on the part of the manager, um, uh, you know he was left in the game uh, in part because we're trying to win the game, in part because um, you know at that point in time and at this point in time there was no deal. So um, it's just uh, you know one of those conundrums where. Uh, there's probably not a right answer, but I have personally talked to Wilmer and uh, um, apologized to him for the situation that he found himself in. Sandy, who, who pulled the plug on the deal? I, I don't really want to get into that, Mike. But you're saying it's not going to happen? No. Nothing in principle even lined up with this at all? No, it, it, it's mm-hmm. nothing will happen. Mm-hmm. Sandy, there was another. There was another player in addition to Wilmer, kind of signed in the in, in, on your side. Going, did you have to speak to him as well? I haven't spoken to anyone other than Wilmer, who was sort of in at ground zero of this. So, how bizarre was it, Sandy? It was a little bizarre, from like inning three to inning eight. So, <clears throat> Sandy, can you say it was a case where you guys did have some kind of agreement and then it fell apart? I'd rather not. I, I just don't want to get into the details. Okay. You still looking for a bat? Uh, it's not Friday yet. 